Hey guys, welcome back. It's Retro Wednesday yet again, and we are doctoring again. So, what we're going to do is we're going to set up quite a few diagnosis rooms this time. So, what we're going to have to do is... Here we go, there's one. No, one door there. Want it there, I think. So what we'll do is if we put that there, and what I'm going to try and do is get as many kind of doctor diagnosis areas in as possible. So that's that there. Now, what I will do is I will put psychiatric in there. I think it needs to be just slightly bigger. Like so, let's put it there. So you've got a door entrance there, I think. So, let's put the comfortable chair there. And with a couch right next to it. Screen over here. multiple radiators but first things first we want the bookcase there and the skeleton there we'll have a radiator there and a radiator there to keep the guy warm and a bin there okay so that's the first one now what I also need to do is put a reception desk right there and let us get a good receptionist there we go. And we'll get ourselves a handyman in. Get him. Okay, so more diagnosis is required. Now the only drawback is what I could do. See, I don't have a huge amount of space there. Hmm, okay. See, I'm wondering if I've done this wrong if I shouldn't put all the diagnosis rooms in here and then everything else in here well no actually I'll, I'll keep it like this for the time being I'll put a pharmacy on the end here if I can so we'll put a desk in there filing cabinet chair there just put that in there now if I put a um, treatment pharmacy in there Damn it, it's not going to fit. Bugger. <sighs> nuts, 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 nuts. Hmm, okay. Now. So. What I'm going to do is put the GPs off it like that, and then I can have them all in a line, like so. Get out of there, for God's sake. Okay. Desk. see what doctors we have available to us. We have a surgeon and a researcher but no psychiatrist. Okay, so we'll have him in there. But also want the surgeon in here as well. Because I need to uh, screw it. We'll have him as well. Now Diagnosis, the GP's office, 
and we'll have a desk, mining cabinet, chair, how much time should I get to plant a bin, mustn't forget them, all important parts of the arrangement, and then over here, what we're going to do is have a treatment, and we'll have a pharmacy directly behind them. Like so. Doesn't leave a lot of space there, that's the only drawback I see at the moment. So, I'll put that there. Put the radiator there. Bin right next to her. Okay. So, there's all that. Put him in there for the time being. So, this is actually going to be the diagnoses area. Now, see, so we've got that large wing there. That's helpful. So, what we need is. I don't think that's going to be enough there's only three there but I still need a staff room in the bog that's the problem now I'm wondering if I can put a staff room on the end here okay so let's put in one of those Doesn't have to be a big one, as the actress said to the bishop. It just needs to be functional and usable. Oh, and that's the point. A nurse. Let's have that nurse there. Okay, so. What we need now is more diagnosis. So you've got the cardiogram and the ward, and then general diagnosis and cardiogram. See, I'm wondering if I should think about putting general diagnosis and cardiogram in here, have this used as another section for diagnosis, and then also, okay, so let's put in a facilities uh, toilets here. And then we'll put another doctor's diagnosis area there. So let's have a look. Toilets. So what we do, we'll put one there. And then, like so. Toilet sinks with weird, yeah, whatever. Okay. So, another diagnosis room here, I think. Or a GP's office, I think, we'll call it. So, this basically will be like just diagnosis and a single treatment. Whoops, Daisy. here, radiator, where can I put the bin, there we go, there goes that, okay, so, what we all so then need to do is, crack load of benches, so what we'll do is we'll put bench, 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 bench. I'll put one there. Loads of benches down the side. Bench, 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 bench. 
benches here. And we'll put some benches here as well. And we'll also put some benches in the centre, I think. So plenty of benches. We also need uh, a couple of drinks machines. So I'll put one there. And one. can we fit the other one there? No, we can't. Let's put another one there. Another one there for the time being. Okay. So plenty of that. Now, what reminds me is, um, I need one of these guys. There we go. So you'll have three. Three pretty good guys. Okay, so, that's kind of like the main doctor's treatment area. Now, what I need is, how much money have I got available? And how much is that? So that's So, what we need to work on is more diagnosis. So, we need a general diagnosis. So, there's a general diagnosis there. And actually, we'll put more windows in there, I think. Yes, go away. Even though people don't want probably don't want to be seen on the treadmill but it's important that we have our staff happy we'll put two radiators as the room is slightly bigger than usual there's a plant and a bin here it's the edge now what we also need to do is put in a cardiogram now that's the only problem hmm. You know what? I'm thinking that might be a good position to put the operating theatre. So it's slightly. So I can put a door there. But then it's a double door, isn't it? <coughs> It'll have to be that big, won't it? Ugh. We'll have to put the operating theatre elsewhere the operating theatre will have to go down there so let us go to the cardiogram like so and hmm. yeah he needs to be there Two radiators, so I'll put the fire extinguisher there. Two radiators. Now, I don't think I can get anything in there, so I won't bother. Now. So, psychiatric ward, I don't have yet. Clinics, inflation. No, can't get inflation in there. Okay, so. Let's put the inflation clinic over here. Yes, I know my dread bank balance is dreadfully low. Shut up and go away. Okay, so these areas are looking good now. This is going to be the area where the other bits and pieces are. So what I need now is I need a trading room. I really need a trading room. So if I put that in there, I think. Okay. And we'll 
put the projector there. And then a little lecture chair. That's all we can do at the moment, but case no, that can't go anywhere. It'll have to go in like that. So, cup. That's better. Okay, so they're both looking at the projector now. Okay, so let's take out a quick loan. We'll take out ten grand so that we can build the operating theatre like so okay now the operating table is there, x-ray viewer Sink and there we go. So that looks right. Radiator there, radiator there. Plant no. Okay. Okay. So we still need one more surgeon. Excellent. Oh, yes, we're having him first. He's going into psychiatry. And we'll also have him as a surgeon. So he can go in there. Okay. So let's build in the ward. No. Nope. We need more money. So we'll build in the um, ward build it like that I think that looks nice okay so put that by the door and then buy multiple beds three radiators oops only one fire extinguisher and so let's put in like bed. And then put another one there. There we go. And then fire extinguisher. We'll put that near the person. Radiator there. Radiator there. Radiator. So, we need an, another nurse there. Let's take the first one, put her in there. And what we also need are benches. So, okay. So that's looking better there now. What do we have? Di diagnosis, we've got all of those. Treatment, we've got all of those. Clinics, we've got that. Facilities, we don't have a research department. Okay, so. Where can I, uh, I wonder if I can put the research department And what I can do, put that there, put the autopsy down the end, and then put a couple of desks, and then filing cabinets around the same desk, and then a filing cabinet, and then over here as well. There we go. And then radiator. No 
nowhere for that, nowhere for the plant. Ah, screw it, we'll put a bit in the middle. Okay, so that's okay. It now means we can build a little thing there if we need to. Uh, what doctors do we have? I need consultants, not a research guy. Good. Now, if I remember rightly, what kind of consultant is he? Okay, he's just a good one. That's the research guy. So let's see if we've got any other good, goodish doctors. Let's employ him. Put him in research. And put him in the doctor area. Okay. Now we need one more doctor. We'll put him there. So we've got basic don't like that toilet. Do not like that toilet at all. What we'll do is we'll drag it out there a bit more. Actually, we'll put the toilet out the door over there. And the window, that's all we need. Um, so, Might need to put more toilets in, I don't know yet. Let's see. Oh dear. Um so where is the helipad mortal point? So that's where the emergency area is. So um what I'm thinking is it might be worth building another pharmacy. Just there. Because the pharmacy is by far and away the one that gets the most business the sheer weight of numbers okay put some benches there and then we'll just get one more section of money and what we'll do is we will put a reception desk Receptionist and then more benches. So we need more benches there. And actually, yeah, yeah, that's right, we do need that there. So hopefully, actually, what I might need to do is change up the design of this and put the door there so people can get to it easier so they crash trolley goes in the there that can go in there okay there we go so at least that's a better option now so we've got another pharmacy over there reasonably good nurse in there okay so we can deal with that. So everyone will come in here, be dealt with by this one. And then obviously what we also need over here is a drinks machine. Hmm. I'm wondering if we need more diagnosis. So put more diagnosis areas in like another two. Yeah, we'll do that because we did not have enough diagnosis errors last time. So, let's see. It means I'm going to be in debt for a while, but hopefully the sheer weight of numbers that come in will make that easier to deal with. And then we'll build, whoops, we'll build another GP. 
more money, more, more bloody money. Um, I want that. This was going to be the treatment wing, but unfortunately, it's not turned out exactly like that, which is a tad unfortunate. But not really much I can do. I need to do this properly. Okay. Now I don't want to put another one on there, but what I will do is put a drinks machine down the far end, and then lots of benches. So we'll put a drinks machine. a place to sit. There we go. And put them in the middle as well. Okay. So that's better. Now, let's see. No doctors there. Ah, these guys. We want him working on that. We'll have him watering plants. And we'll have him focusing on letter. Now, no doctors available. Okay. Okay. I think that's as good as I'm going to get. So, what I'll do is I will put the game speed up to normal. And open. I don't care, I shut up. Excellent. My first customer, and I'm already in debt. Look at that. Oh. Wages. Yeah, that was what I was going to do. It. Okay, heat the piles, excellent. So she's going to go and get my first success, possibly. Yes, first patient cured. So let's see what our victory status is. So at the moment, yeah, it's got to be reputation's good, hospital's worth it all. I've got to cure 350 people. Okay. It's far too cold. Okay, so. We can't at the moment. All we're going to do is basically just let things progress. On the way to the ward. Okay. Good. There we go. Let's turn the heat up a bit. TV personalities, yep, yeah, that's understandable. So Yeah, so my bank balance is gonna take a hit for a while while I am getting the reputation I need for loads of um, heels and all the rest of it. So. Not heels, but uh, cures. There we 
we go. Catches one around, but then one does not. Money should slowly start coming in. There we go. See. Now what I might do. Put that guy in there. And that guy in there for the time being. Okay, so we've got a cast remover. Now we're going to wait, because we can't really do much with the cast remover yet, we don't have the money, how much we do, oh crikey blimey, look at that, hey, look, heating cart, the wages, that's what's really doing it for me, so we'll have to see how things go, because I kind of need these people actually, how good is that researcher? So, oh, they're both okay, but I need to research stuff, so I don't have much choice in the matter. Okay. Put him back there. Put him back there. Oh, for God's sake. There we go, put that in there. Uh, it's not been used yet. Don't go and change. God. Here we go, the old backless gown, aren't they wonderful things? Hop on the operating theatre and get surged. situation. So these guys are all dealing with everything. Billy Savile. Okay, so the money's starting to come down, or the, the negative factor is starting to come down, which is good. Infectious laughter, oh dear. Spare ribs, yep, yeah, we've already got the surgeons for them. Yeah, we can handle that. Yeah, the injury on by is they'll come all the way through here, down to here, and then get surged on. So put him in there. Get him to relax. So there we go. We'll keep an eye on him. As soon as he is ready. And this guy's nearby. There we go. We'll move him into there and get him set up. Here we go. Slap tongue. the hell? Oh, for God's sake. They want money already. Good, he's next on surgery list. 
Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. There we go, come on, come on, come on. Oh, thank God. Come on, get onto the table. And what's taking you? Constant pay rises. Okay, sorry, sending the patient home. What's this? So, at this current moment, oh my heavens, look at that. The squits eating pizza found under the cooker. What kind of idiot would do that? No, I've never done that, in case you're wondering. Come on. So it will get better, the monetary situation, as things improve or pe more people start coming in. So you can see here value is there you go see so the value's going up and the reputation's good so it's just the bank balance I need to get sorted which will recover in time and then I can put the slack tongue places and these people the fracture clinic these two once I get the money together so it'll probably be the fracture, fracture clinic the fracture clinic and then the slack tongue clinic straight afterwards so lots of relaxation going on there thank goodness transparency licking the yogurt from the foil tops of open pots wow a pharmacy drink of specially cooled and coloured water cures this disease. Sounds like homeopathy to me. What? Did I just kill one? How the hell did I kill her? And she died right in front of the BIP. That's a tad unfortunate. If I kill six patients, I lose the level. Oh dear. That can't be good. Here we go. Check her bits and bobs. There we go. He is really, really slow. Unexpected swelling. Okay, so that's okay because we lost that last time, which pissed me off. something out to look at that that's all fine it's 
see, I need a better doctor. Holy hell. He's good. I can't hire him. I just turned it down because they were saying they were too hot, and now they're saying it's too cold, and to turn it up. No pleasing people. So where is my psychiatrist? with the squits. Oh wow, super hospital, even though somebody died in front of him. Obviously I think... Okay, let's see what this emergency is. Eight people with invisibility, yes. Because then she can go in there. So you have got, you can go home. Put her in there, and then she can deal with the invisible patients. Yeah, so you killed one person, which is good. Oh. What? What? Did I just lose? Oh crap, I did as well. Bugger. Oh well. <laughs> we'll be back next week with the next episode. More of the same, probably. Uh, based on that wonderful performance thus far by Chad. So... Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.